Hello again, everybody. It's been a while. I have been remiss in recording my videos and uh, I'm getting quite a pile up of stuff here uh, to show you. So my name is Daryl and um, I do business on eBay under uh, World Peace Clothing. Um, but most of the time I just like to go to the bins, which is in Seattle in the Soto area. And um, it's uh, the Goodwill outlet. And, and then report back to you what I got and show you um, some, you know, fun ways to put things together. So I'm going to start out with what I'm wearing, um, which is maybe not always my normal style because I don't wear boots and, and, uh, and belts that have horses on them very often. But here, let's show you this. <laughs> I liked it because it was sparkly, right? So um, the bit, the boots that I'm wearing are Nine West and they are literally brand new. It's got a pointy toe and a slightly stiletto heel, I guess. Um, the top is from Zara and I love this top. I knew when I saw it, I would like it because I already own it in white. <laughs> but this one needs to be ironed. Um, but um, it's a, a nice piece. It goes with a lot of stuff and it's flattering. So, um, and then the jeans I'm wearing are made well. And these have a button fly, an, an exposed button fly. And, um, and they're just a high rise uh, straight or skinny jean. But I wanted to be able to show you this awesome coat. Um, I don't know what the brand is. Oh, maybe I do. Did it say? Yeah. Guess not. And, you know, I've been kind of steering clear of these fuzzy coats because they're all over the place. But this one I just thought was super cute when I put it on. It's like, oh my gosh. So how could you go wrong? <laughs> this is the super soft plush. And um, I actually, I couldn't wait to really wanted to get this stuff listed so I could start wearing the coat. <laughs> See? Make sure I don't run into anything. So I'm going going to um, try and and edit videos together so that they um, are cohesive. <laughs> so um, I'll show you a few more outfits. I only got. Uh, couple bottoms. I got these pants and a couple of workout bottoms. So I'm going to show you a bunch of tops with these jeans on. So, okay. This is a cashmere layered top from Inhabit. And as you can see, it um, has sort of a Henley clothes here, but this is what's kind of cool about it is it has this under layer piece that goes all the way around the the top so that there's a little foundation. It's kind of like wearing two shirts, but it's only one, huh? <laughs> anyway, uh, I didn't see any flaws in this piece. And, uh, you know, I like my cashmere. So uh, this is pretty awesome. Um, the retail on Inhabit pieces is usually um, uh, close to $200 at least. So, okay, now we have um, a crop or a midriff top, and um, I don't have, there isn't a brand on it, there's, uh, so, but it's all over stretch, and it has a double panel in the front, so you have a little bit of, uh, of coverage, and um, show you what that looks like. Uh, as I said, I don't know what the brand is, 
And then this jacket, this is a shacket. And this is from uh, Anthropology brand, Avec les Filles. I've been working on my French. <laughs> and uh, this is a size small and it's kind of a sweatshirt material. It matches my walls. <laughs> Hello, I'm color coordinated. <laughs> <laughs> so all righty um got another top here and this is from sundance and I couldn't find a current comp for it. Um, it has a, a handkerchief hem. And uh, get back here so you can see it. So it's pretty awesome. It has these insets on the side. And then this uh, embroidery and, and uh, handwork done on the front of it. So I don't have a comp for it. Um, but the, the Sundance stuff is... Um, Kind of pricey sometimes so uh, this is a really good find and really the more I look at it the more I like it uh, so onward to the next one so this was probably my best find of the day um, I think at the bins they thought maybe these were men's dress shirts um, but no they're not um, and there were two of them and they're in excellent condition and what they are is Lafayette 148 and these have a retail of between four and five hundred dollars um, and they're just beautiful stretch cotton dress shirts uh, i'm just i love i love this piece um, it, this is a large and and it's still fine you could do all kinds of things with this uh, from the half tuck you know and and uh, rolling up the sleeves so so it gets you can wear this over shorts you can wear this over a dress you could tie it at the waist you can wear it under a suit you can literally do anything with this top it is so easy to dress up and down and uh, flattering as everything uh, so super duper happy with this piece see I don't know what the back looks like but <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and there were two of them. So, best deal ever. This is a top from Miss Me, and I want to show you this detail up here at the front. It laces up, and uh, you know, so you can tighten it or loosen it as you want. I've uh, done a half tuck with the hemline, and it has um, just a kind of a t squared off back there, and the spaghetti strap sleeves, and this all over embossed fabrication. And this, I think, is going to be just a super good vacation piece. It's just a summery boho uh, look. Okay, so I wanted to show you this piece from Eileen Fisher. This is, um, I believe it's a small, and it is knit. I'm not sure if you can tell that here in the in the video. Um, but it's a long, oversized tunic piece. And um, just has a really pretty drape. Um, and this is a new tags piece. Here we go. And uh, yeah, it's an extra small and it has a $149 price tag on it. And uh, so you could do a lot of stuff with this. Um, I would, I'd want to rein it in somehow because um, it's uh, a little blousey, but this is good. Okay, this is the 
the last piece that I'm going to um, show with the jeans on. Um, and because the rest of my stuff um, are pieces that I'm just going to show you or um, uh, I'm going to move into the athletic clothing mode. <laughs> so this is from Zara. As you can see, it's cropped with a, a dolman, dolman sleeve. Yeah. And um, I am infatuated with this color right now. Um, so I just think it would look good. Uh, I think with white would look just so good for summer. But, you know, it's okay for for just a play date. <laughs> Whatever. Um, I'm not really sure what the fabric is. It's got kind of a nice hand to it. And it's just really a uh, nice looking piece. Uh, could give it some attitude here. Move the collar up. <laughs> okay, gang. Time to get dressed up and go somewhere. I guess I don't know where I would wear this ever but this is from Topshop and it's fairly uh, current um, I did find the comps for it uh, but I don't remember what they were how's that <laughs> so it's just a um, kind of a bodycon it's a stretchy fabrication here as you can see um, and so I'm not sure. I would probably wear something over it. I find this kind of interesting. <laughs> I wonder if that was intentional. <laughs> so I don't know. The dress is my size, but I'm just not really sure that I would um, wear it anywhere. Maybe I would. Hard to say. Okay. This dress is from Haute Monde. Moaned, H A U T E M O N D E, and as you can see, it has a plunging neckline and a twist at the waist here. And what it actually is is um, kind of an overdress that fits over this short little skirt here. So um, I kind of like it. It's sort of sexy but not too crazy revealing if you know what I mean <laughs> okay now I'm going to show you a couple of workout pieces I got and uh, these are 7 8 um, pants. They're a compression pant. They're from Lululemon. And I like they have a nice high rise waist. And these are from a number of years ago uh, because I own a pair of them. But look at how current they look now. I mean, they're just pretty awesome. And I've got kind of a looser shirt that I'm wearing with them. Okay. And then I also have uh, this brand new with tags, Madewell tank. Now this is not technically a fitness tank, but um, you could certainly wear it that way or you could wear it with uh, any of your summer pieces. So there's that. And then there's just this awesome, I'm not sure how well this is going to work um, with the tank. And in fact, let me uh, fast forward here quickly. Okay, this is another Lululemon piece. And this is um, a half zip, I guess. It has thumb holes. 
It has some seaming details uh, in the back. It has um, these strips. It has this cool pocket that's off to the back, which is kind of awesome. Um, at any rate, I have no idea what size this is. My guess is um, from the way that it fits me, which is snug, <laughs> is that it's probably a six. Um, it might be an eight. It's hard to tell with some of these Lululemon pieces, but it's wearable, um, in my opinion. I've been recording my video workouts so that I can, uh, just kind of look at, at my form and, you know, how I'm doing stuff. It's illuminating. <laughs> And this is a mesh top. I'm going to show you that mesh top. This is from Michael Stars, and it has a solid background. You see that? And uh, I like this because it's sort of the athleisure look. Um, you could you could wear this with anything really. It would look good under um, a blazer, um, but and it would look really good with these shorts that I'm going to put on. <laughs> um, but it's good like this and um, couldn't find a comp for it uh, it's, it's probably a few seasons old but uh, kind of a nice piece to have what was it a quarter okay and then this is one more sweatshirt type piece this is made from stretch bamboo and um, it's just awesome. It's a brand I haven't heard of before that's called Perilous Activity. And uh, it has these mesh insets in the arms. And um, do they anywhere else? Yeah, they go around the back like this. And they have a dolman sleeve or a raglan sleeve. And um, all of are super stretchy. You could probably wear it... Um, with the wide neckline like this. And it's cut wider here and then nips in uh, at the waist. If I move it down to where my waist really is. <laughs> but it's actually a really nice looking piece. It retails for $108. And uh, hmm. I put it on with the uh, shoes I had on earlier, but I can't find them. <laughs> <laughs> so I also want to show you um, the other pair of Lululemon uh, pants that I got. And these are exactly like the ones I have on, only a slightly different color. So you can see they have the ruching in the leg, but it pulls out. And you look how tiny these look. But, you know, they, they uh, go to this 7 8 length. See how long they are. So, and just all over compression, super flattering. I'm going to dig my other pairs out. I have them in pink, too. <laughs> so, and uh, just a couple more pieces to try. So, let's go with the shorts here. Okay, and last of all, or at least for right now, this, these are um, Fabletics shorts. I'm going to show you they have a, a drawstring um cotton elasticized waistband and then uh the balance of the shorts are like um oh uh like a rip stop uh what's the stuff that i can't even think what the name of it is but anyway you can hear <laughs> and then this is a top this is from lululemon and uh do again. I really like uh, drawstring shorts that have a, a wide leg. I just, they're comfy, but they're also good looking, right? You could wear these with um, a, a blazer. Um, would look super cute. Um, anyway, these are kind of a light, very light gray color. And as you can see, this is a heathered, 
black and gray Lululemon and I have no idea what size it is. Uh, but definitely wearable and definitely keepable, huh? Okay, and this is the last piece that I'm going to show you. Um, I was pleasantly surprised when I put this on and saw that that it just has sort of a, a body skimming fit. It isn't tight. It's uh, sort of relaxed and it's very flattering with this uh, mock neckline and the set in sleeves. Uh, again, another piece you could wear almost any way that you wanted to. I don't remember what the name of what this is. It was a fast fashion brand. My, I don't remember. Uh, and now, so that's what I've got as far as the stuff to try on. I, I could try on some more t-shirts for you, but I think, you know, when you've seen one, you've seen them all. So here, so okay, my friends, uh, we're down to, um, I have to say there's still a lot of stuff to show you, so I'll try and make um, pretty quick business of it, but. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> um, I, uh, I have a receipt here and I'm going to tell you how much I spent um, on all of this stuff. Came to $47.16 and that included tax. And this was on March 24th that I went, so it was a little bit ago. Um, but I got a lot of good summer stuff, huh? Can you tell? This t-shirt, which is a great color, kind of a rose pink, is from A New Day. And it's really a nice fabrication. They do a good job. So, um, another white t-shirt. This is from Divided. Which I think is, uh, Divided is H&M. Always good. This is from J. Crew, and this is their fine spun T-shirt. Super soft and a little more sheer than uh, another T-shirt. I have to tell you too. See, I got these uh, boot trees. They came in the boots. <laughs> <laughs> which will be kind of nice. And I really like that they have a hanger <laughs> so I can hang them up. Right now, all my boots and shoes are in um, muck bins. And I have all my heels and the ones I wear all the time on a bookshelf, which works really, really well if you're looking for a place to put your shoes. <laughs> since, we're, since all of our books are online now, <laughs> Might as well do something with those bookshelves. Um, this is my very favorite, Made Well. Just kind of a boxy tee. And this is um, just a super nice tensile blend uh, t-shirt from a newer label, Eileen Fisher. And um, it's just kind of a classic t-shirt uh, with a fine rib and it is made out of yeah, tensile, lyocell, and spandex. This is from Express and it's just a classic cami. It's got two layers of fabric in the front which is always nice. By the way, um, the, the um, mock turtleneck crop white top I had on previously was from Express. So not really that fast fashion. <laughs> um, this is something that I'm not sure if it's a cardigan. It says it's a shawl. It's a giving shawl. Let's see what it does. <laughs> this is new at Tags. And it was just a little floppier than what I was wanting, but I do like these shawls that have pockets in them. Like this. So here's its tag. 
But to me, this looks kind of like a bathrobe. So, you know, it might, <laughs> I, it just looks like I should have bunny slippers on with it. Here's the other side. You know, it's okay. But really, I, I think I would wear it just to stay warm it in the evening. Um, now I'm going to show you this. This is super interesting. <laughs> and you might find this weird. <laughs> but what these are, um, are brand new uh, pieces from a brand called Hanky Panky. I'll show you one. And they run about, um, oopsie, $20 a pair. And I love them. They're this boy cat, boy cat. Um, but anyway, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pair. You know, that's uh, $160 worth of lingerie right here. So, someone must have lost weight or something or gained weight. Um, this dress is awesome and it's got a $350 price tag on it. The brand is called Allison New York and you can find it online. Unfortunately for me it is a size small and it really is a small. And show you this flounce with the embroidery. Oh gosh, isn't that awesome? Oh, my Roomba is trying to gain entrance. <laughs> so, you know, you can get an idea for about this here. Isn't this just sweet? Here's what the rest of the balance of the dress looks like as well. Just gorgeous. And then this is another piece that I knew wouldn't fit me, but I bought it because I knew what it was. Um, it's got a $298 retail. The brand is Parker. And it is a sweet uh, cross front surplus neckline romper. Come along tags. There we go. Isn't that cute? I will list this on eBay. Coming soon. And this is from Free People. And uh, it's a kind of a swing hemline dress. You see this? So it's got a lot of fabric there. And um, a sheer bodice and sleeves and that it's got some sparkly bits so this is going to be cute I think in the fall and I think I would wear it as a mini dress which I believe is what it is so those are the stand-up pieces <laughs> Let's move on to these are Hollister, I believe. Yep. Paper bag waist shorts. And I love these front patch pockets. Uh, more lingerie. This is new with tags from Anthropology. The brand is uh, Sleeping on Snow, I believe. And, um, yeah. And I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with it yet, but it has an $80 retail brand new uh, oversized scarf. Um, this is uh, sweet. I'm going to 
brighten this up a bit. It needs a little loving care in the laundry. Um, but we're, how, this is really cute because what you do is you tie the back up. You cinch it up around your waist and you tie it in the back. Would look really good with the Lululemon pants, you think? And I got this because I'm like a parrot. I like anything that's shiny, but it really didn't do me any favors. Um, and this is from Forever 21. It's just a sparkly piece and another sparkly piece. And sometimes these things look good on and other times they look matronly. And this one looked matronly. It's from Ann Taylor. Don't need any matronly. And this is um, from Spanx. And I think it's got like a 40 something dollar retail. It's a reversible, um, seamless sports bra or a under foundation piece. What else? What else do we have? Oh, there was a whole bin of Brooks t-shirts. And I think that these are, um, men's t-shirts. These are size small and um, but they fit my size medium frame nicely and they have I think I don't remember what the retail on them was but it was around $50 I think. I could have gotten 30 of them if I'd known what to do with them. As it was I got one for me and I got one for my neighbor. <laughs> Oh, nine pair. And then this is from Marine Layer. Uh, and this is a size small and it is a really nice fabrication with stretch and something soft. Uh, see if it's in there. See if I can read it. <laughs> this is made in California by adults. <laughs> to know. <laughs> it is Supima cotton and modal. So yes, nice fabrics. So I think that's the end of it, my friends. And now I just hope that I can get through all of my, um, my little clips and put them in the right order and that they make sense and that they look good and and you know what? Maybe we'll actually gain some traction and get better at this. So share this with your friends. I so appreciate um, the new subscribers that I'm getting. And uh, I just really look forward to uh, doing more of this. And hopefully that you're having a good time watching them too. So subscribe. Watch them all. See you later. Bye.